Hi, by the end of this series you will be able to start any type of awesome Arduino project. In this video, we will go through the basics of Arduino. Hardware components in how to set up Arduino to work with your system. Arduino is an easy to use microcontroller that you can program to run any code you want and create cool projects. The most popular type of board is the Arduino Uno. We also have multiple types of boards fit for different applications like the Arduino Mega, the Lilypad and the Arduino Nano. For our purposes let's look at the Uno and its components. The USB port is used to connect the board with your computer and also to exchange data with it. Most Arduinos use standard A to B mail to mail type peripheral cable the kind that's usually used for printers. The reset button does pretty much the same as unplugging the board and plugging it back in. It restarts your program from the beginning. The same thing happens when you program the board. The USB interface presses the reset button for you. That then enters the bootloader for a second or two so it can try and program it. The pins on the Arduino can be configured as either inputs or outputs. The pins 3, 5, 6, 9, 10 and 11 are PWM enabled that is these pins can mimic analog output and input using pulse width modulation. PWM is achieved by rapidly varying the output between high and low for the desired percentage of time. The Arduino supports a 5.5mm slash 2.1mm DC barrel plug center position. The recommended voltage is 9 to 12 volts at 2 ampere. The AT Mega 328 is a single chip microcontroller created by Atmel in the Mega AVR family. The Atmel 8 bit AVR risk based microcontroller combines 32 kilobytes ISP flash memory with read while write capabilities 1 kilobyte EEPROM, 2 kilobytes AS RAM, and 23 general purpose IO lines. An analog signal is one that can take on any number of values, unlike a digital signal which has only two values, high and low. To measure the value of analog signals, the Arduino has a built-in analog to digital converter. The ADC turns the analog voltage into a digital value. ICSP stands for in circuit serial programming and it is a protocol used to program microcontrollers like the PIC and the AVR chips. ICSP pins are used for programming Arduino or Atmega chip using another Arduino or connecting the Arduino board to a computer when the USB is not available. The VIN pin provides power to the Arduino board. We have two ground pins, a 5 volt output pin, a 3.3 volt output pin, a reset pin, which resets the board and restarts the running program. Now let's look into how to set up the Arduino development environment. Go to your browser and search for Arduino IDE. Go to the Arduino website and download the installer. Install. Upon launching, you will see that we have a brand new project. Connect your Arduino board. Let's set it up. Go to Tools, Board, and select the board of your choice. Let's select Uno for our purposes. Now go to Tools again, select Port and you will be presented with the list of Arduino devices connected to your computer. As you can see, we have a device connected to our PC at Port 5. Let's select this port. We have now set up our board and are ready to go. Let's look into the code in the next video. Hit thumbs up if you liked it and please subscribe if you loved it. Thanks and see you in the next video.